Let's compare the storage capabilities of the Regal MSO 5000 series against the Tektronix MSO 2000B series. Both instruments are recently calibrated and the Tektronix is running firmware version 1.56. Let's start by capturing a CSV file from the Tektronix MSO 2000B series. To begin with, let's go into the Acquire menu and change our record length from 100 kilopoints to 1 million points. Once I've done that, I'm going to then go into the storage menu. And then within here, I'm going to save a waveform. I can choose my source, which I want to be channel 1. I want my destination to be to a CSV file to my flash drive that I've already inserted into the front of the instrument. I'm then going to press save. And then within here, I'm going to make sure it's saving to my flash drive. And I'm going to hit OK. Well, the Tektronix is currently saving the CSV file. Let's look at the Regal instrument. To begin with, let's go into the Acquire menu and set our memory depth to be 1 million points as well. And once I've done that, let's go into the Storage menu and go press Save Wave. And then within here, I can select our storage location to be the flash drive. Let's do that. And then I can choose data source to either be memory or screen. We're going to go with memory, so it's the 1 million points. And then our format is also set to CSV. And I can also choose my channel to be all four channels or the logic channels as well, or just one of the channels. And since we're only saving one channel on the Tektronix, we're going to go with one channel as well. And I'm going to hit save. What we'll see here is the Regal is going to save its CSV file about 50 times faster than the Tektronix.